Good afternoon, guys. Welcome to Rogue's Group. Nice car for you here today. Um, this is the first of the facelifted. This is actually a launch spec motor car, November 2013, 63 registered. Uh, black Sapphire BMW 320D SE 7 seater. Okay, done a smidge over 90,000 miles, guys, with a uh, beige Dakota leather, which really lights the cabin of the car up. But the clue with this, guys, it's sub 20,000 pounds because of the miles, but it is first of the facelifts car, which is a which is a much better example, obviously, as an eight speed auto servotronic steering 245 low emission. Um, uh, three litre diesel engine so uh, these are my seven seaters of choice good spec car as well guys being launched spec it comes with um, well it came with uh, power fold mirrors heated front sports seats which electric adjust um, privacy pack obviously third row seating which is why we're all here hi-fi loudspeaker system dynamic pack which makes it almost like an M Sport they weren't building M Sports at these at this time but this is an M Sport spec car um, a connected driver, 19 inch alloys. Purpose of the video is to go around the car in detail, tell you a little bit more about it as we go, um, and Oakwood. So coming onto the front bumper open, we've got front and rear park seating guys, LED daytime running lights, Xenons with power, headlamp wash, front fog lamps, on this age related number now guys, probably been on private numbers. Look guys, car's eight years old now guys, yeah, it's done 90,000 miles, expect the odd stone chip and paint blemish here and there, but overall, the car presents itself extremely well. Headland bezels are all clean and tidy. Leaning into the bonnet, it's all in good order there. A couple of little marks in the bonnet here, guys. Stone chip there, a little bit of bird lime there. We're not gonna get involved in it at this price point, but it's there nevertheless. Rest of the bonnet's all okay. Windscreen, genuine BMW, no major chips or cracks on that screen. Roof's all clean and tidy. Coming around the paintwork of the car. Paintwork looks to be original to us. Okay. Um, but yeah, great, great four-wheel drive, seven-seater motor car, this. Up to the front wing, on the passenger side, that's all clean and tidy. Love this black stuff there. It's proper black, not the carbon black, which is the bluey black. 19-inch upgraded alloys there, guys. Modest, they're also showing signs of a little bit of wear, but overall present themselves well. We're not gonna get involved in that, guys. Um, and the tyres are recently new. May 2020, the car had a four new tyres on it, so they're all at seven mil. Read the reviews on these guys, they get rave reviews. I've got three sons. I've had several X5 seven-seaters. They, they are my seven-seater of choice. They drive so car-like, and uh, they're super, super reliable as well. So I really, you can see why they're so popular. Up onto this front wing, on the driver's side, that looks to be clean and tidy. We've got power folding mirrors, guys. They power fold in successfully. That alloy is generally good order. There's some small marking on the outer edge, but nothing more sinister than that. That tire's new at seven mil. Got running boards there. Onto the uh, driver's door, that's clean and tidy. Rear door, rear quarter, factory privacy is all where it needs to be clean and tidy. That alloy, some signs of wear on the outer edge, but nothing worse than that. And some tires there at seven mil. Inside the car's lovely, guys. There's no bad odors. We've got this lovely, ivory white dakota leather which really lights the cabin of this car up okay most of these are black but this has got white leather in it we've got a parcel shelf for the car obviously that's why we're all here guys it's oops it's a seven seater okay but like i say no bad odors in here we've got two keys to the car and just a nice place to be obviously eight speed servotronic car okay a little bit old because we've been trading since 2001 we're based in a little village called east farley outside maidstone in kent 20 years trading guys small workshop and mot facility on site everybody that works with me is vast motor trade experience um read our reviews at autotrader.co.uk guys we are well regarded with nice people to buy used cars from those those reviews will bear that statement out um, and we're very fair and straightforward. Those reviews have taken five to six years to amass, and I think that shows um, consistent high levels of customer service. But back to this lovely 7 seat X5, round to the back of the car, in amongst the bird song. How beautiful is that? Um, LED rear lights, we've got rear park sensing there. Uh, car's got a single, um, single electrics tow bar, looks less, little use to us. It's a swan neck, it's in the boot of the car, which I'll show you in, the more, uh, in, a, in a moment. Privacy to the back, power tailgate. It's not Lassie's Revenge in here, guys. All clean and tidy. You know, for 90,000 miles, car presents itself remarkably well. Parcel shelf, little used tow bar there, and the tow bar bag. As I say, that, that leather just really lightens the cabin of this motor car. So I think it's got about six services with BMW on the monitor. Last service was done in May. May 2020, where it had a major service, and we got to put front and rear brake pads in it. It's just been newly MOT by ourselves. Rear quarters clean and tidy, rear door, 
front door, small uh, car parking dent. Actually, we get our dent, guys. So look at that. That's uh, quite bad. So we'll get that sorted. That alloy is in uh, relatively good order, and that's the last of the new tyres, seven mil. So new tyres, guys. Nearly MOT'd. Recently serviced with loads spent, and we're putting new brakes in the car in terms of uh, brake pads. Okay, so it'll want for nothing. Just seeing lovely, lovely condition. Oh, really good seven seater. American Oak wood pack there, electric seats, sports seats with seat heating. Okay, it's part of the dynamic pack, guys, that's why. Although this is an SE, it's M Sport spec. We've got two keys for it. Here's the provenance check, guys, tells you what it is. Okay. So it's a three on a, a two on a motor car, last done in six years, guys. November 2013, first of this style. Okay, uh, launch spec car, hence the specification. Here's the MOT records, which is a matter of public record, guys. That's the MOT we've just done to the car. And then you've got all the other MOT tests there, which is a matter of public record. And this is the last independent service invoice that was carried out in uh, May 2020. Okay, so quite a big service there. And as I say, we've newly MOT'd it. We'll put it in front and rear brake pads in the car. I've driven the car, car drives beautifully. You can just see power fold mirrors in beautiful condition, guys. A little bit of wear on the seat there, consummate with eight years, 90,000 miles, I guess. Put memory seat pack, two keys. Let's start her up for you. So that's asking for brake pads there, guys. Vehicle status. Uh, let's have a look at the service requirements. So there's the service history, guys. Yeah, so full BMW history there, plus that independent invoice that we've got. We've got to do the front brake pads, the rear brake pads, but nothing else is requiring for a long period of time there, guys. Okay, so heated seats, cruise control. There's the mileage today, guys, 92,300. So there we go. Never many of these facelifted X5s under 20,000 pounds, and there's certainly very few with ivory leather and seven seat options, so been looking for one of these guys in this house and kids these are probably the best seven seats of four-wheel drive car car driving like suvs in the marketplace i've had several great car thanks for watching